Hi guys, Linda Antwi with the Red Carpet Report. We are here at AFI Fest for the centerpiece screening of Rust and Bone. We're going to talk to a whole bunch of actresses and actors, so come on, let's go take a look. Good to meet you. So tell us what your film is about. Um, it's a short experimental film that's kind of like a representation of, of the death of film as a medium. So it's just this like kind of abstract little piece that I made on a light table in my basement. Um, it's about a three minute film and kind of represents, I like to work with film a lot and within the past few years the ability to work with film has been like some people would say film is dead and like the the ability to see film like projected on a screen in theaters is like there's it's less and less so it's kind of like an ode to the beginning of the end of film yeah. as a medium that's awesome yeah. tell me about the camera here you have um this is a super 8 camera so it's uh, got some black and white film in it and i just brought it with me just to kind of thought it would be fun to document the whole process on films. So. And have you been documenting it? Yeah, just um, other people on the red carpet and just the whole um, experience of being at AFI, so yeah. Is this your first film fest? Um, it's not my first film fest. The film premiered in Canada, where I'm from. I'm um, Canada. Are you? Where, yeah. from? where are you from? I'm from Edmonton, Alberta. Born in Toronto, but raised in Vancouver. Oh, wow. Hello, fellow Canuck. Yeah, I'm very happy to be here because um, there's not 10 centimeters of snow on the ground, so. <laughs> Yeah. Absolutely. I spend the morning on the beach, so yeah. 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 And how how many times have you been to LA? Um, this is my third time, so um, it's my second time to AFI. So and my producer Trevor Anderson has been here a few times with other films. So yeah, it's been a great experience. So. That's wonderful. And what are you working on now? Um, I'm working on a, a couple documentaries about one's about an Arctic weather station that my dad worked at when he was 19. So in the middle of nowhere where the sun didn't come up for three months in the yeah. middle of winter. So um, working on that and a few other um, short documentaries as well. So. If our viewers wanted to find you online, are you on Twitter or on your Facebook? And if you are, what are your handles? Um, I'm not on Facebook, but they can view my website, which is AaronMunson.com. How can you not be on Facebook or Twitter? Explain that to me. I don't know. I've just, I found that I've split my attention so many ways and there was just one more split that I couldn't do. So I'll probably, you know, give in eventually. But for now, I've just kind of stayed back. So. Got it. Well, thank you for stopping by.